Hello, queens and kings. Jacqueline Haley here, Hand of the Queen. Well, I'm coming to you this evening with a um, package that I received yesterday. And it is coming from the lovely Olivia Hernandez. I'm sure many of my friends are familiar with Olivia. And I'm thinking that Olivia has sent me uh, a challenge. But we're going to open it now and see what Olivia has sent. All right. Let's get into it. If this is an entry, it is number five. So I have labeled it as number five. And let me go ahead and slip this end opening here. All right, and let's get into it. It's a lot. If this is an entry, it's it's packed. It's it's not required that you send extras. All right, let's let me get into it. I'm glad I didn't snip too far. Um, this must be a note. Dear Jacqueline, I'm sorry I took so long. My mojo is hard to come by. I hope you like your bag. Did not sew. Use glue. LOL. Hope you are doing good. I could not find my uh, Rolodex. I believe she's saying Rolodex cards. So, somewhere in my craft room. LOL. Love always, Olivia, 2024. Okay, Olivia, that's fine. Whatever. All right, let's get into it. What have you done? Oh, my goodness. Make sure there's nothing else in the bag. Um, let me see. Where do I begin? Um... Let me move everything aside and let's let's open this handkerchief um, wrapped package first. Uh, she knows that purple is my jam. So I have a beautiful and it's a very sheer cotton. I believe it's cotton and it's embroidered with uh, purple flowers. She has a safety pin here with a uh, glass bead. And this is the back. Now let's open it. All right. I want to lose my bead. All right. And yes, it is a cabinet card entry. Isn't she lovely? Here it is, an altered cabinet card. Look at all of the um, appliques, the um, beading, the beads, the bling, uh, the crystals, and there's various... Um, trim there's a piece of a doily here this is a fabric uh trim here at the top feels real velvety like and this large floral applique there is a ecru lace here it's on a it's got a sheer netting on it Now, let me make sure I don't miss anything now. Oh, this one does flip up. And it says, Happy Birthday, Jacqueline, always Olivia Hernandez. And she has her angel here, 2024. And this is the back where she has her insignia. It says, what I make with my hands, I give with my heart. 
and this is the back beautiful piece of uh, scrapbooking paper she has glittered the hands on the heart i mean the the heart onto the hands here i am getting tongue-tied again all right okay that is that oh she is gorgeous i'll come up close and I'll turn it to the side. Another gorgeous entry from one of my lovely, lovely friends that I've known for some time. All right, now let's get into it. And let me open the next. Let's go to the wrap package. I don't know where to go. Everything is so, uh-oh, don't want to drop that. Well, wait a minute. Okay, let's, no, okay. I think we're good. I don't know where to go. This is a beautiful wrapped uh, music paper. It's like a pattern tissue paper, and it has the music notes on it. And she has this cotton crochet, uh, has it wrapped in this cotton crochet trim. And then there are two beautiful um, lavender mauvish type roses, silk roses. That is the bag. Let's open it now. Here's a lovely strip of washi tape. And you know I will save the wrapping paper, the tissue paper. I love tissue paper. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Olivia, what have you done? Oh, my goodness. Are you all seeing this along with me? This is a wall hanging. I want to get it right now. It's a wall hanging. And uh, it's a cabinet cord lady. Isn't that gorgeous? Look, I'm going to turn it to the side. Look at all the beautiful applique work. Uh, this is an acrylic flower with pearls in the center. She has ribbon roses here. Glass bead. No, that's a rhinestone center. Uh, so many details. Uh, the hanger is out of a white twine or and uh, crochet cotton lace uh, she has dangles at the bottom I hope I'm in frame there are dangles at the bottom there's a large applique here running across the bottom of this wall hanging now let me come up close so you can see the the vintage lady, the cabinet card lady. All right, and then on the inside she has, oh my goodness, this is Olivia. And this is the back of the bag. Look at that beautiful piece of um, corded ecru uh, lace. All right, let me put that down. Now, here's another piece of that gorgeous uh, tissue paper. Oh my goodness, Olivia. Here's what's inside of that. Tied with sorry silk ribbon. There is a, I just lost it. It's an original crystal, a crystal uh, from a chandelier that was on the bottom of the tie. So I don't want to lose that either. And let's see what we have. I'm going to look at it first. <laughs> Sorry. We have a boy and a girl. And on the back, it's a, uh, I believe it's in, 
it's in French. I did not take French. I know very little uh, Hispanic or Spanish, but I know some, but not French. It's a harder course. And then we have another postcard of a couple. And it is, I believe it is in French also. Oh, did I show the back? I'm sorry. And here is the back of the other one. If I didn't show. All right, we have those. Then she has, in this envelope, she has crafted with this scrapbooking paper, a pocket. Inside the pocket, my goodness, she has it lined with a uh, vintage music paper. And there is a, oh, that's part of the scrapbook. And then she has a, a doily piece here on the corner. And then inside the pocket, she has, let me find something. Okay. She has a man cabinet card. She has another man cabinet card or mail. And then she has gifted me a lady or a woman cabinet card. My goodness, Olivia, you only had to do one original cabinet card. Oh my goodness, this is a collection. We have a, I think he is a boy. Um, the back, I can't, it's got some um, writing on the back. Let's see, did I see the other ones? Yeah, there's something on the back of this one as well. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm trying to do better. I don't want to miss any more details. Oh, my goodness. And that is the back of this one. They're all antique. Here is a sweet, sweet little girl. Look at her. Isn't she darling? Oh, my goodness. And this is the back of her plane. And then we have... Let me see. Let me put these down. Olivia's got so much here. It's going to be hard for me to get everything on the table. Then here's a cabinet card that comes in the original, um, you know, the, this is the way it comes. So this is her. She's very old and delicate. The original folder for the card. I don't know if there's anything on the back. No, because she's backed with this oval uh, like frame. She's beautiful. I love, love, love cabinet cards. And, all right, then she has another one in the original folder. This is a baby. It says her name is Mary Berdina, March the 11th, 1919, age eight weeks. And she weighs 12 pounds. That is her. I'll come up closer. Isn't this something? 1919. Oh, my goodness. And then we have yet another. This is a sister and her baby sister. There's nothing on the back of this one. And this is what this one looks like. Uh, McLean and Cole, 174 6th Avenue, established 
12th and 13th Street. Um, late with, I can't make it out. And this is this one. And then she has yet another one. Ridgeway Portage. Uh, looks like her name was Norm, Nora Turney. Very faintly written on the back. This is her. And you can barely see her name on the back there. Thank you so much for those, Olivia. Uh, they will certainly be added to my small collection. All right, then Olivia has an envelope here. Antique French paper book. Oh, my goodness. You know, everybody's going bananas over French anything right now. And Olivia sends me antique French paper book. All right, I'm going to leave that on there. This is the envelope. She's decorated. And let's go in here and look at this French paper book. Oh my goodness. Here we have this picture. There's another one on the back. What does it say? Some type of um, um, bridge. I can't read it. All right, and then we have another one. And we have this one. There are, you know, everything is in French. All right, and then here are the, some pages from the book. And this one, Instruction, could make that out. Hope you're seeing these. Very, very fragile, and they're very old. They're antique. Here's another lovely page. And here we are again. I don't know if I will want to, to use some of these, but I have plenty to use. Um, here is a book, Lutheran Almanac, says. And it's an almanac book. So, you're going to see plenty of pages here. All right. Moon and the stars and everything. And then here's a bulletin page. Several pages of that. And another, this is wonderful paper. Oh, the feel of it is, you can tell it's really antique because the feel 
is wonderful. The way it feels, oh my goodness. All right, thank you so much for that, Olivia. You are doing too much, girlfriend. Too much. But I appreciate it. I'm not going to put those back in the envelope right now. And put that on this side. Now let's see what else, Olivia, what other damage she has done. She has gifted me this beaded um, sequin and pearl beaded applique or embellishment. We have that one. I don't know how this is going to pick up on the thumbnail so much. And we have another. They look like they're AB um, sequins. So we have two of those. Then she has gifted me a beaded um, piece here. Floral. All right. And then she's all of these beautiful velvet flowers. Well, let me show that last. And we have this, um, this is a rhinestone piece here, Sylvia. Um, these are rhinestones. Olivia may have glued those centers in. I'm not sure. Oh, I was out of frame, sorry. Looking at it myself. All right, and then she has gifted me this beautiful, beautiful, oh, I think it's a collar. Look at that. Look at that AB and the, all the other AB pieces in it. Gorgeous, just gorgeous. I can't tell if it's, I think it's baby pink. Uh, yes, it is. It is simply gorgeous. I love AB stones. Olivia has some gorgeous, gorgeous stuff. All right, and then she has this. Have I already shown? No, this is another baby pink applique with um, rhinestones. And then she's gifted me all of these beautiful, beautiful, let me get something, velvet. Uh, she's made these by hand, I'm sure. Um, road velvet flowers and I do love gold and purple and you know that's my jam the purple I don't want to miss anything I hope I haven't missed anything Olivia you know I missed a couple things on some prior videos and I did a retake and if I have missed anything I will certainly go back and do a redo, a recapture of what I've missed because you all have taken the time to um, send all these lovely things and uh, you want the details to be shown and I do not mind because it was my error. <laughs> and blame it on the head and not the heart. So uh, let me see here. Thank you all for watching. Thank you so much, Olivia. Uh, you have done way, way, way more than you should have done. This is the altered cabinet card. I'll make sure, did I open it? Did it? Does it open? Yeah, I did that. <laughs> I don't want to miss it again. All right. And then you've seen all of the lovely originals. So again, this is Olivia Hernandez.
very dear friend, another dear friend. And if you don't know Olivia, be sure to go to her YouTube channel, which is Olivia Hernandez, and see all of the beautiful, beautiful uh, handcrafts that she does. So again, thank you all for watching. I hope I haven't missed anything. Um, happy trails. We will meet again soon. Um, I know what else to say except goodbye. Oh, good luck, Olivia. And I have neglected to tell everybody else on their videos, good luck in the draw. Um, you know, I've been leaving some stuff out. I'm sorry, guys. But good luck to you, Olivia, and to all the others. I think I had made in the um, comment section or the description, good luck. But I, I need to say good luck. So, again, <laughs> I'm leaving now. Thank you, Olivia. And hugs. Goodbye.